Hello and welcome. Today we're going to look at reduction of liquidity as a hidden cost for self-funding case expenses at a contingent fee law practice. But before we do that, I'm going to test your knowledge of a common business term, and that term is market value. What is the definition of the market value of an asset? Is it A, the amount most recently paid for the asset plus inflation? B, the amount a willing buyer would pay a willing seller? C, the value as determined by a licensed appraiser? D, what a seller would be willing to sell it for? Or E, the replacement cost of the asset? Well, stay tuned to the end of the video for the answer to that question. For now, we're going to look at reduction of liquidity as a hidden cost of self-funding your case expenses at your contingent fee law firm. Liquidity is a a term used to describe how easily or quickly an asset can be converted into cash. So the standard for that is cash itself. Cash is the most liquid asset that you can hold. And it moves away from that as you get into things like uh, a home, a car, stocks, whatever it might be. They all have their own level of liquidity. And the more liquid, the higher market value of the asset. So let's look at an example. Let's say that you had just won a uh, contest and you have your choice now of two prizes. Well, I'm speaking to you from Nashville, Tennessee. So let's say one of the prizes was a home here in Nashville uh, valued at a half million dollars. You could have that as your prize or you could have a suitcase full of cash, a half a million dollars in cash. Which would you choose? Like me, I'm sure you would take the cash. Have you ever thought why? Well, liquidity has something to do with that because you can take that cash and use it more easily to purchase whatever you'd like to do or invest whatever you'd like to do with it. Whereas the house, if you want to do something other than have the house, you'd have to put it on the market. There would be costs associated with selling it. Uh, so your net uh, in the end would probably not be a half million dollars. Now let's apply that same concept to the amount you have tied up in case expenses. I'll give you a similar choice. Would you rather have a half million dollars of cash on hand or the rights to be reimbursed for a half million dollars of case expenses someday? I think it's pretty easy to see which has greater value. Uh, it's the cash. Now, what is the difference between the two in value? Well, it's hard to put your finger on that, but it is different, and that amount of difference is one of the nine hidden costs of self-funding your case expenses. Well, now it's time for the answer to our quiz. What is the definition of the market value of an asset? If you said B, the amount a willing buyer would pay a willing seller, you were right. Well, the term market valuation can apply to any asset, including the funds you have tied up in case expenses. So when you take your half million dollars of liquid cash and you put that in your cases, you've dramatically reduced the market valuation of that asset. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel for future updates.